Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for June 1st of 2022. Well, it is titled Tau Hercules Meteors over Kitt Peak Telescopes. So what do we see here? Well, in the foreground, we see a couple of telescopes that are part of the Kitt Peak National Observatory and out in Arizona. And there are a large number of telescopes on the mountain there. And that is a it turns out to be a very good site in terms of the weather and dark skies that are there for astronomers being able to observe the universe. Now up above in the sky, of course, we do see a large number of stars and we can label a couple of those here for you. And in fact, we see off to the left in the center, you can see the big dipper there. That might be a little bit hard to trace out uh, with the handle pointing upward toward the top and then the bowl down towards the bottom and pointing kind of just to the left of the two telescopes that are seen here. And that is one of the objects. The other is the constellation of Hercules, which is labeled towards the top up above the telescopes. And if you note the meteors, they seem to radiate from that area. Now the meteor shower is named based on the constellation or area in the sky from which it seems to radiate. So this is called the Tau Hercules because they seem to come from the general direction direction of the Tau star within the Hercules constellation. And if you trace these back, you'll see that most of them seem to be coming from the same general direction in space. Now that occurs because the meteors all come from an object in space, generally a comet, and they travel together parallel in the same orbit. And therefore, when they strike Earth, they all seem to come from the same direction, much as a telephone poles or railroad tracks will seem to converge off into the distance here on Earth. These will appear to converge off into the distance up in the sky. And we note if you look around, you'll see a couple of them scattered around that do not seem to follow this same pattern. So you can actually look and see of those what happens to be about the same uh, same direction and others that are not quite following the same direction out in space. So you might be able to see a couple of them that seem to be tilted at a little bit of an angle relative to the others and not quite pointing back to the same area. Now the final thing labeled here is of course one of the bright stars in the sky and that is the bright star Vega. Vega, one of the brighter stars in the sky in the uh, late summer and fall, summertime in the fall, uh, is one of the brighter stars in the sky. And we see that labeled here off to the right hand side of our image. So a number of the Kitt Peak telescopes uh, with a, uh, the Tau Herculid meteor shower, which peaked uh, last night as a, a as a meteor as a shower of meteors small debris left behind by a comet struck Earth's atmosphere and we saw a number of them here vaporizing up in the Earth's upper atmosphere. So that was our picture of the day for June 1st of 2022. It was titled Tau Herculid Meteors over Kitt Peak Telescopes. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then have a great day everyone and I will see you in class.